everybody, this is Praxis, and we're about three quarters of the way through the day, and things are going really well. Uh, Amber was here earlier today, and she did some first passes of exterior wall boards. Uh, my dad is here. He's been working up at the top gable end of the roof. I really haven't been involved in that at all today, other than just handing him things up if they fall or he's forgotten something. Uh, I've been working exclusively on these back walls of the greenhouses. You can see all the uh, posts are all in place. Uh, you can see that they're the lighter colored lumber because they just came from the, the, uh, from the lumber yard. Those all went up uh, in place, and now I'm starting to work on the exterior, I'm sorry, interior wall boards. Just like I did on the south-facing side of the greenhouse, I'm alternating uh, so that on one side, it's the groove, I'm sorry, the, uh, the tongue is facing upwards on uh, this side, and on the uh, opposite side, I have the groove facing up. And the reason for that is that when I uh, take this and I cut it at a 45 degree angle here to get the next piece over there, uh, you'll notice that the, the point on the next piece uh, is conducive to having the groove facing up. So that way I'm not having to cut out a, a huge uh, a, you know, piece of waste uh, for each of these uh, you know, courses as they go up and it just, you know, it's much more efficient uh, with the uh, wood. You'll notice that this line here, I kind of uh, sanded it off. I changed my mind afterwards. The reason was uh, when I made that line, I realized it was gonna be a really useless piece of scrap that was gonna be generated on the uh, uh, end of this board. So instead of using this for the, uh, the next piece that I was using, I got a longer board and I cut the longer board off to uh, make that piece. And now when I uh, bring this over, it's gonna be that much longer uh, and it's gonna have a much uh, more appropriate bit of scrap that I'm gonna throw away because it's, you know, a lot smaller. So things are going really, really well. Uh, just uh, working across there. My dad's uh, finishing up there, probably be done the next five minutes or so. Uh, just like, uh, you know, I've been doing the entire time with the greenhouses, I'm working on both at the same time. So back and forth, back and forth. As I did each of these posts, I did one on one side, one on the other. And we're doing the same with the, uh, the greenhouse roof up there. I'm sorry, not the, uh, the regular roof up there. Uh, the little end cap that he's putting in, we just made a second one. Well, he made a second one for the other side. And it just, uh, you know, you got it in your head. In fact, it's right over here. Uh, you've got it in your head. You know what you're doing. Uh, you know. It's, it's easy to just make a second one. And th this is the piece that he's putting just right at the top there to create a, a guard so water's not getting between the two pieces of trim that come down. So things are moving really well today. We were supposed to have uh, potential for rain. It was a low chance, only 20%, but we haven't had any of that. It's been a really great day for working. And tomorrow looks like it's gonna be the same. So, you know, things keep steamrolling forward never as fast as you'd like. But I think within a couple of days, we should have these backs all sheathed up, maybe get some foam on there. And then I can continue wall boards all the way across on both sides, and that'll be a nice feeling to have one complete wall of the house completely done. That's it. Thanks for watching.